And a warm welcome on what is a fine day for football. I'm delighted to be able to report. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you live action from Liga. It's Clermont Foot, and they take on Stade de Reims. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. Well, they've got a good front three and a solid back five, but with only two in midfield, they could get overrun. It'll be interesting to see who comes in to support them, if anybody. And a look at the starting lineup for Reims. Well, on paper, they look a very balanced team. But the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. And they kick off here. Very quick thinking there. Grejon Kjei. Pressing high, and they have the ball again. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, three goals in the last three games. He's in great form at the moment. He's playing with confidence as well. Every chance he could add to that tally today. But he could really get at the opposition. But timely defending when it mattered. Opportunity it is. And a goal! 1-0. And what a fast start they've made to this game. Well, let's see this again. He tries to run out with the ball. He has the ball taken off of him. He's made the wrong decision. And suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Terrible defending. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? A danger here as he runs at them, but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Plenty of options. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Can he finish? Pretty routine there for the goalkeeper. Marshal Munetzi. And they need to get tighter here. Gives it a go. It's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident. And not giving the opposition much of a look in.
Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. now and back on the way good tackle take it away Azor Matusiwa Well, half-time coming up, and this is not exactly what the home fans came to see. Stuart, your thoughts on what we've seen? Well, they can certainly play better than this. It's been a disappointing first-half display from them. But if they can just play with more urgency and energy in the second half, they can get back into this. They definitely have the quality. Monetsi. Continues his run. Well, nothing productive, really. Gone along. Gone along. Being egged on by the crowd. Always going to be the goalkeeper's ball. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. And there it is, the half-time whistle. And I think it's fair to say he's had happier days in front of goal, Stuart. Well, Derek, he's usually so clever around the edge of the box, but today he just hasn't shown that. As the touch map shows us, he hasn't had enough touches in those key areas. And now they get the ball rolling. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. And the emphasis is on creativity. But nothing comes of it. This is looking threatening. And with that, the attack fizzles out. An alert intervention. Oh, it might be! Really good diving save. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Over it comes. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. And he's beaten him here. Can he finish this? Oh, wonderful save! Well, he reacts so quickly there. That's a great save. <laughs> and he's fired over the corner. The clearance wasn't decisive.
And with that, the attack fizzles out. Can they create something from here? Well, didn't go to plan in the end. The pressure was high, and they could be in here. But it's great when you can rely on your keeper. This has been a top-class display today. Just look how many chances they've created. And if they want to, they could score a hatful of goals here. Yes, the chances just keep on coming. No stopping them, apparently. Already closing him down here. And the referee blows for a foul. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up. And now both will rely on their respective benches. Clean challenge. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. And unable to keep the ball. And the referee takes exception to the challenge. Free kick. Well, very effective play in possession. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Say do. It's opening up for them. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And support available. So two minutes of stoppage time here. Greg John Kay. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. Well, Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them. Just didn't look as sharp as normal. I don't think they deserved anything from the game. They need to get a better performance in next time out. Well, I don't think, Stuart, anyone can really quibble about what he put into the game. Well, I thought he was excellent. Not only did he score a good goal, but his general play was outstanding. He certainly played a major part in their win here today.